Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Aiman Akhir Muhammad Zaino. Alongside with my fellow presenters, Zahiri Hakim Zainuddin, Is Afif Muhammad Lidla, and Muhammad Abdul bin Zamli, we present to you our poster titled "Determining Learning Style for Muslim Gifted Students Among College Students in Sun Foundation One Students." The VAP model of learning styles suggests that there are four main types of learners, which are visual, auditory, reading or writing, and kinesthetic. In this research, we want to identify the best learning style for college students in Sun Foundation One students. Our objective is to tell the students about their own learning styles, whether using visual, oral, kinesthetics, or reading. Method used is by collecting data from 97 different 13 years old college students in Sun students with different backgrounds. It is estimated that 97 participants will give positive results in this test. We are using VAP questionnaire version 7.0 that consists of 16 questions by using Google Form. This questionnaire is still reliable as the latest version of it, as it is only one version ahead of it. Surveys are useful in describing the characteristics of large population. The anonymity of surveys allows respondents to answer with more candid and credit answer. To get the most accurate data, you need respondents to be as open and honest as possible with their answers. Then, the data is being recorded and tabbed using Microsoft Excel. And finally, data taken is arranged specifically within each group and will be analyzed using statistical package for social science, also known as SSPS version 26. The percentage will be calculated by dividing the total of people in each group and the total of the participant that has conducted the test. Comparison has been made after all the data has been calculated. The result of our research shows that the most preferable learning style amongst the Muslim gifted students is the oral learning style with 36 respondents, followed by kinesthetic learning style with 28 respondents, visual learning style with 20 respondents, and read learning style with 12 respondents. The total number of respondents is 96. However, when sorted into their own five respective classes, the results from the data taken shows that each learning style are distributed almost equally for the students with small differences. The data that was processed using SSPS shows that the learning styles of the Foundation 1 students are varied and different from the past. Students used to be more kinesthetic than visual and auditory. It shows that kinesthetic learning style was more preferable among students before. However, since the first wave of COVID-19 pandemic, students are forced to learn using online platforms. Thus, changes in learning style were necessary. There was no difference in preferred learning styles between the genders. The oral and kinesthetic learning modes were shown to be the most preferred one. Therefore, the current lectures and the exposure to practical learning are two strategies that students can employ to succeed in their classes. This will also assist the teacher in creating a learning environment that meets the needs of the kids and direct them towards improving their test score. As mentioned in Al Quran, means that as you are weaving yourself, can you not see? Surah Al Zariyat, verse 21. This verse told us that we, as a human, must learn ourselves to get to know more about our Creator. With the help of this research, we can help them to know themselves better. To conclude, this research is focused on exposing Muslim gifted students on different learning styles. According to the analysis, a student's learning style can be impacted by a variety of circumstances. The learning style of each student can be determined. Knowing one individual's learning preference can help make class time more productive. As a result, it will help in more intelligent and advanced learners. And that concludes our research presentation today. Special thanks to our supervisor, Dr. Amnah Zanariah Abdul Razak and Ms. Aiman Fadila Ahmad Rosli for helping us in completing our research. That's all from us.